Hey guys, how's it going? Today I have the last of my advent calendar videos for you. And it was my favorite. <laughs> uh, the Molten Brown one. Uh, this is a great box. Um, the packaging is, it's a very heavy box. Um, I, it does come to you from England because that's where Molten Brown is sent from. Um, the packaging is, uh, got jingle bells on it. It's also magnetized right here, so it does shut. This is very sturdy cardboard. And then the inside is absolutely beautiful. I love this box. It makes you feel like you're opening a little gift every day because each one of them actually boxes. Um, you have to shut it right though. I will be sad to recycle this, but I'd be glad to have my space back. So, say love you. Okay, um, I'm gonna go through it all. Obviously, I recommend this box. I think it's awesome. If I'm through all these products by next year, I will for sure try to buy this box again. Um, I think it's an awesome way to try their line. You try probably at least half of their fragrance line, you know, their fragrances in their line by trying these products. Um, they also give you like complimentary products that go together um, so that you don't have a shower gel and a lotion that are different if you don't want to, um, which I think is awesome. Um, yeah. Okay, so I'm going to ram through these. I feel like uh, my feelings on the Molten Brown calendar are very evident in that I like them. <laughs> um, uh, all these bottles are 50 milliliters unless I tell you otherwise. They're very generous. One of these little bottles of shower gel lasts me probably like 10 or 15 showers. So um, they're, it's a very like, what should I say? Um, like robust amount, like you, you, you don't need very much of this to, to wash your whole body crazily enough. Okay. So Ylang Ylang body wash, Ylang Ylang, uh, moisturizer, nourishing body lotion, I guess is the phrase for this one. Um, Ylang Ylang comforting body polisher. So you can do body polishing. I am super pumped to try this. And then crazily, they send you also a Ylang Ylang candle and they actually seal them like the top is sealed, um, uh, although I'm taking away for this and I really like it. Um, and it's a one ounce candle in a very like beautiful jar. Um, they also send you, I think they're paper on their candle line, it must be a new line, um, the catalog of all the different candles um, and instruct. oh actually it's just instructions on the candles and the, the like fragrance collection and stuff like that is in here in 55,000 different languages. Um, let me put this over here. Okay, then you get a 100 milliliter orange and bergamot hand wash. Oh my god, this is hands down my favorite scent. I like bergamot. I like dark smells though. Um, this is a very lovely, like, kind of, uh, like, Middle Eastern spice markety smell. Mm. Um, I love this guy, and this is a really nice size. It's not too small, not too big. It's great. Um, this is a cocoa and sandalwood body wash. This is a delicious rhubarb and rose bath and shower gel, and I smelled it, and it does in fact smell delicious. I wish they had given us a candle in that. Uh, ginger lily body wash. Ginger lily lotion. Ginger lily, heavenly ginger lily caressing body polisher. Surprise, ginger lily candle. Sealed. Day 12 is a black peppercorn body wash. It does smell like peppercorn, like no joke, but in a really awesome way. Yeah, it's not like gross. It's, it's just peppery, which is kind of unique and nice. And I like these kind of scents. Um, a thing about this box is you could theoretically give it to a couple and they could enjoy it together because a lot of these scents are good enough, like, smelly for men. Uh, so that's an interesting part. Indian Crest Purifying Shampoo. Never tried their shampoo before. Super stoked to try that one. Um, Mare Rouge Deep Conditioning Mask. Uh, so it's a hair mask. So I think I smelled it, did I? Um, it is not heavily fragranced, which is lovely for a hair mask, so that's great. Um, pink Pepper Body Wash. Um, it's the body wash I'm using right now, so yay. Pink Peppered Lotion. 
What do you guys think this is gonna be? Seen a pattern? Uh, <laughs> a fiery pink pepper pampering body polisher. It's funny that the polishers all have like, an extra word. What did the healing healing one didn't didn't know? And surprise, surprise, a pink peppered candle. I'm dying to know what the candle smells like because that's interesting. Um, Dewy Lily of the Valley and Star Anise Bath and Shower Gel. 800 milliliter festive frankincense and allspice fine liquid hand wash. Festive frankincense and allspice. What does that smell like? Let's give it a smell. Oh, it smells like frankincense and allspice. Surprise. It's good. This one is the Tobacco Absolute Bath and Shower Gel. Mm. This is my jam. I like tobacco scents. Mm. And it's like, it's still a little sweet. So it's not overly mannish. I have one that's oud. That's a manny smell. Believe me. I don't mind a manny smell, but some ladies don't. This one is not manny. Uh, Alba White Truffle Hand Exfoliator. And an Alba White Truffle Hand Treatment. And on the 24th day, you will get a, what is this? It's a Molten Brown, obviously. Vintage 2016 with Elderflower Bath and Shower Gel. Like, sparkly bobble situation. You can put this on your tree. Mm. It smells like apple pie. I like it. Anyway, that was what was in the Molten Brown catalog um, of Advent. If you're interested in getting this for 2017, it comes highly, highly recommended. It is a, I think, I want to say it's like $80. I'll put that down below for you so you know how much it costs. Um, it was a great deal, whatever it was. Um, I spent a lot more than that in the Molten Brown store. <laughs> so um, I really like their body products a lot, um, so I can't recommend it highly enough, and I think this would make a fantastic gift for someone you love for Advent, or I don't, I'm not, I'm not religious, so, <laughs> um, I do Advent calendars anyway. Um, it's a, it's a fun thing to do during the holidays. So, anyway, I think this would make a great gift for you, or for someone you love, or for a couple, or for someone who's, like, very into trying different smells. Um, yeah, so... Anyway, I hope this review was helpful for you. I uh, can't recommend it highly enough. Probably will get it again. If it was, give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you guys later with another video. Bye, guys.